Cancer, hello. For those of you who have been here before, welcome back. And for those of you who it's your first time, welcome to you. I'm Denise, and this is Surrender to the Flow Tarot. And I'm going to be doing a timeless general reading for the collective of Cancer. So that's Cancer Sun, Cancer Moon, Cancer Rising or Ascendant, or Cancer Venus. It's a general reading. It's not going to resonate with everyone. Take what does, leave the rest. Be careful not to put yourself in a story that isn't yours. So you don't want to relate to it. You want to resonate with it. Okay. So what we're asking the universe today is what do you need to receive? What do you need to release? And what is going on around you that you're unaware of? And we are using the Ex Animo deck by Bon Aguer, um, which is this. It's all major arcana. It's a artist in France who I'm pretty sure prints them herself. They're super dope. And to clarify, we're going to use either one of these, the field or the tarot of mystical, mystical moments. Okay. So my Cancerians, are you ready? Here we go. Wow. You're doubting yourself? Maybe. Wow. <laughs> That's a lot. Wow. Wow, Cancer, there's a lot going on. So there's some kind of transition. But you are in the middle. You are in the midst of it. Definitely in the thick of it. But I think going toward the end. Yeah, you're going in the last stretch of it. The bottom of the deck is the sun. This glare. What you need to receive, which is sideways and going into the reverse, is the judgment. This is what you need to receive. This is letting the transition happen. Let yourself ascend. Let the final outcome happen. What you need to release is the moon, which is moving into the upright. And what's going on aware, around you that you're unaware of is the world in reverse, the lovers, lover in reverse, and the devil sideways moving into the upright. Okay. I think that you're on, I think that you are self-sabotaging, but you don't realize you're doing it. And because you are, you're holding on and you're self-sabotaging, you still feel really, 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 really connected with someone. 
And it's so hard for you to let go of some of that person. Until you let go, until you detach yourself. Until you detach yourself from the belief that you are that you are supposed to be with this person, that you will be with this person, you're not going to move forward. What moves you forward is getting to a place where you say, "Okay." This sucks. I, my heart is so full. You don't want to say my heart is with this person. It's with that person right there. No, no, right? My heart still feels so connected to this person. But this is what is best and this is what reality is. And it sucks really effing bad. But I accept it and build yourself back up, heal yourself up so you get in a place where you can stand and you don't care. You are not attached either way to whether you get back with that person or not. Because what you are is eye on the prize and that for you is your 10 of pentacles, is your true complete fairy tale. That's where, what you want. That's, that's what it is, not this person not this person. It's you and getting yourself into a place where you're always in alignment with that. And that will bring in whoever is meant to be in your life. Do you understand what I'm saying? You got to let go of those preconceived ideas that you have or those then those attachments that you have and you have to heal yourself. You got to heal your grief, you know? All right, Cancer, that was really to the point. I know that you're sad. And I know that you, you're working hard on this. Do some self-care, and I mean that in the indulgent way. You know, whatever that is. Do the indulgent self-care, like the luxurious self-care, however that defines, help decadent, however you define that. And then do the care and keeping self-care of your sleep, your eating, your hydrating, your physical needs, okay? Thank you for coming and sharing your energy with me again, Cancer. And I will see you again next week. Hope this helped. Bye.